best friends. Hi guys, it's Talisha and today I'm competing in the Robertson Spring Show which is all hacking so I'm going in quite a few classes today because I have my rider class, I have my Galloway classes and then the breed classes which is Australian Riding Pony. Um, I might also do the Pony Club classes depending on how Jep's feeling because that's after everything else apart from the breed classes and the breed classes are only like led and ridden so they're a couple classes so depending on how she's going we may do them but at the moment I'm probably not going to um yeah so I'll quickly show you guys what I'm wearing before I get completely ready so now you don't have to deal with a dirty mirror because my mum cleaned it for me um <laughs> I'm wearing my spooks navy and red show coat and yes that's pretty much it then I'm wearing a red tie and a and a target collared shirt and then with those I'm wearing my Peter Williams show breeches with my Thomas Cook black leather bit belt. Then socks. I didn't have any of my riding socks because they're all dirty. So I'm wearing my van socks. <laughs> and yeah, my boots are in the car. I'm just going to put some trackies and my Mac and Mall trading jumper over the top. And then I'm ready to go. Well, Kai's coming and Jep's at the other end of the body paddock just standing there. And Kai's like, oh, hey, I'm here though. So... She likes to do this on show morning. She'll come over to me any other time. Oh no, she's walking. So, Jeff has got her shipping boots on at the moment. She's got her Mac and Mall trading rug set on. She won't stand still because she's really impatient. Um, so, she's got the purple and yellow tail bag, show rug, hood, and the slinky underneath. So, you can get these in so many different colours. And if you want to buy one, you should go to their Facebook page, which is just Mac and Mall trading. She does have an Instagram account, but she currently can't respond to messages on it, so it's just easier if you contact her on Facebook. So yeah, we're gonna get going soon. Dad, um, Dad thinks he's late, so he was. <laughs> Best friends. Yeah. Oh. So I just put Jeff in the float and she's all ready to go. We're just waiting for mum and dad to come out, which should be really soon. You're... <sighs> then go around to her face. that I'm showing you today for each class I'm either showing you clips from the ring or clips from my workout or maybe even a mixture of both and then I'm just gonna tell you the place at the start so it's easier and then I'm gonna make it a bit shorter so this vlog isn't too long so I hope you enjoy it and yeah I'll just get right into it so this is obviously my rider class which was my very first class and as you can tell because there's all the horses around this is based on the ring so the workouts are pretty much the ones if you can just see me Followed by 
on lead mirror filling, then lead gilding. Five stars, ring seven, ten o'clock. Ring one, we jump a couple of classes. Ring one is the adult pony hack. Intermediate pony hack over 12-2, not exceeding 14 hands. Next event, ring one. Intermediate pony hack over 12-2, not exceeding 14. Next event. Okay, so I'm just sitting in the car right now because the Galloway classes are finished and I have like an hour or two until pony club classes oh tilly's riding go till <laughs> so i have like two three pony club classes that i can go in and then i have another hour or so break until my lead australian riding pony and ridden australian riding pony so there's a huge gap jeff's just chilling outside and having a little nap but yeah so as you saw we would have we got reserve champion galloway which I was very pleased with. So, yeah, I'm just eating twisties. Um, because I'm hungry as. And yeah, that's, that's where I'm at. Mm. Pony is just chilling, eating. <laughs> and she's tacked up for the Pony Club classes now. They've run even later than we thought. So she's had a big long break without a saddle on. And now she's ready to go and do some Pony Club classes. Oh, and then we have her breed classes. So I actually only ended up doing my rider class for the pony club classes just because they were running really close to my Australian riding pony classes and I really didn't want to miss my riding pony classes. Plus I didn't mind not going in an extra like two or three events or whatever it was. It didn't really bother me <laughs> because I was just really happy with how Jet performed all day. So yeah. got second. I am back from the show now and um, it was a pretty successful day on behalf of Jeppo. Uh, I wasn't the biggest fan of some of the judges decisions she made today. I don't think she was the biggest fan of me but hey it happens sometimes you get judges that aren't a fan of you or your horse. The joys of hacking. <laughs> But we came home with two reserve champions, reserve champion Galloway and reserve champion Australian Riding Pony. And then I think I got like, I got two firsts and then six seconds and one third. So Jeff went amazing. I was so happy with how well she was. Um, I felt pretty good in my classes. I was pretty happy with how I rode today. But obviously the judges didn't agree in some cases. Obviously I'm still very happy for the places I got and the fact that I still got two reserve champions. I'm still just a bit funny with the judge, but hey, it's all good. My pony was great, so that's all that matters. Um, I've just put Jep back in the main paddock with Kai at the moment, but I'm about to go and move them both to a different paddock because this paddock needs a break so it can grow back and then I'll slash it so I can get all the poo gone. I'm going to the Holly Hall Fun Day next weekend. So when this is posted, it will be the coming Sunday. It's on the 29th of October. I was going to do the Rossmore Sporting Day, which I was really keen for because it's just sporting, but they clash. So I'm going to Holly Hall. And if you guys are interested in going to Holly Hall, the details of how to contact Jan are down below. But pretty much what the fun day is, it's not a show at all. It's really good for taking your horses out for the first time. 
you have access to a full show jump course, full cross country course and ranges of different heights, indoor and outdoor arena and it costs $60 and you can show up at 9 and leave at 3 or you can just show up whenever you want honestly. So I'll be there as well. I Last time I rode Jep at, and got there around 10, 11-ish and I rode Jep around the cross country course, just did bits and pieces and then I went back and got Kai which I will be doing again so I'm going to ride Jep there first and then I'll take Kai up because I like getting him used to everything and exposing him to all the horses and stuff. So if you guys do want to meet me, I will be there pretty much all day. But yeah, so I have more details about it on my Instagram, which is Talisha Beardsmore. So if you want to check that out, please do. And if you want to come to the fun day, just use the email or phone number down below of Jan Chesterfield. And yeah, that's pretty much what to do. So I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog and I will see you guys next week. Okay, bye. Oh, and I will also be vlogging the Holly Hole fun day. So if you come, you might get into my vlog. Bye.